Here's your 41 Action News update. I'm Kristen Dubill with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines for this Tuesday, October 15th. Missouri Governor Mike Parson signed an executive order today to create a new public safety campaign. Its goal is to spread awareness about the dangers of vaping for teenagers. Three state agencies will work on the campaign and plan to have it ready within a month. It comes after a surge of vaping related illnesses across the country, including two deaths in Kansas and one in Missouri. A sign the GM strike may be close to an end. Today, GM's CEO and president joined company negotiators to speak with union leaders. The strike is on its fifth week now. The union also called GM, UAW presidents, and local leaders to Detroit Thursday. There are members of the union council who discuss voting on tentative agreements. KCK leaders will discuss the future of the T-Bones baseball team later this week. Thursday, it'll look over a proposed stadium use agreement with the team's new owner, Max Fun Entertainment. It comes a day after the city switched the locks on the T-Bone Stadium and evicted the team for not paying all of its bills and debts to the city. Your forecast is next. Thanks, Krista. A little breezy out there right now and around 8 p.m. 51 clear, still a little on the windy side. At midnight 45, increasing clouds. The wind will come down and by tomorrow morning, 38 degrees, partly to mostly cloudy and much less wind. And by noon, 48, partly cloudy. We'll be in and out of the clouds during the morning and then tomorrow afternoon, not bad. 55 sunny and just a light wind. Warmer days ahead Thursday and Friday as we get close to around 70 Thursday and in the 70s Friday. You have your news and weather anytime on KSHP. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.